What's up everyone? Over the years I have watched a bunch of videos on YouTube that have people talking about all the different ways you can spot fake or bootleg DS games. They'll point out how sometimes the front label can look a little different, or on the back side of the card it can have different engravings, or even sometimes the contacts can look a bit off. All these are good ways to help you figure out if a game is fake or not, but on all these videos, personally, I've never seen anyone mention the one guaranteed way that you can spot a fake or bootleg DS game. And I was like, I have a YouTube channel. I sometimes make videos. How about I do a video talking about it? Now, over the past 20 years, I've worked at different game stores, and I've bought and sold a lot of video games. And this is a tip that I have always told to all my employees or co-workers, and it has definitely helped keep a lot of fake DS games from coming into the stores. I have a real copy of Mario Kart on the DS and a fake copy of Pokemon Heart Gold. And the way that you can always tell if you have a real or fake DS game is looking at the top side of the cart. So here's the front, right on along the top side. On real ones, there will be little indentions in them. On fake copies, it'll be smooth. I'm going to zoom in now so you can see the difference between the two. On the real DS cart, you can see along the top edge, right in the middle, that there are multiple rectangle-shaped indentations, both in the front and back half of the cartridge. All real games for the DS will have these markings. It does not matter who the developer or publisher is, they'll all have them. These are markings that come from the mold itself, from the mold that the plastic is poured into to make the game case. On the fake DS game, you can clearly see that on the top edge, there are no indentations at all. It is a smooth surface. Both the front and back half of the cartridge are completely smooth. All fake games that I have ever come across look like this on the top side. It's that simple. If they have the indentations, it's real. If they don't and it's smooth, it's fake. And this info will help anybody buying DS games. It doesn't matter if you're a collector buying like high-end expensive ones, because a lot of DS games are getting way up there in price now, even for loose carts. Or if you're just your casual player that's buying like Mario, Zelda, Pokemon, and you really don't care about collecting it, Either way, unfortunately the fake ones are usually made out of much cheaper materials, the contacts wear out really quick, or they just stop saving for some reason. Uh, I've even seen really bad ones where the cart itself is actually like a weird dome shape because there's like a little micro SD card inside and this the cart itself won't fit into the DS because there's too much of a bulge. So hopefully this info can be passed around. Everyone will know it. Um, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like, leave a comment, uh, subscribe, hit the little bell notification, marry it. I'm pretty sure you can marry videos now. Anyway, thank you all for watching. Love ya. Peace.